We recently had a question about kidney stone size, specifically how big of a kidney stone can pass on its own through the ureter without say like a surgical intervention. And we actually have a trusty little kidney stone here that we received from a patient. But as you can see, this one is larger than that ureter and as it would move down there, that could stretch and cause pain there. But the treatment protocol generally says anything below like a five millimeter stone will typically pass without much intervention at all. But anything between five and 10 millimeters, they'll usually at least step up to a minimum of Flomax, which is an alpha blocker medication, which helps to facilitate the passage of the stone. But that wouldn't be considered a surgical intervention because that would just be medicine. But anything above 10 millimeters could require much more of an intervention. What do you think about this one? Do you think this one would have passed naturally? Well, we have some measurements we can take here and this one's about eh, seven millimeters ish. And so this one likely could have passed with just medical management only with some of the Flomax and pain management.